Hi everybody. Well, today's kind of a sad day for me. It's been 23 years ago since I lost my first husband, Wayne. I'm going to show you some pictures of him. This is him, Wayne. He died very young. He was only 43. You know, the sad thing was he died the day before his birthday and it was really hard. Here's a picture of him when I was carrying my oldest daughter who also does my filming. Here he is when my daughter was only a couple months old. And here he is when he did when he and I starred in Dracula, which will be done at another time. We're going to definitely honor Dr this when we did the play Dracula in December when the show was. Well, today to honor Wayne, I'm going to make him. I believe he liked a lot of apple crisp, peach crisp, a lot of sweet stuff. So what I'm going to do? Oh, by the way, this has already been washed. I'm going to slice the peaches up. You know what, people? I think I caught a summer cold. I don't know where it came from. But sometimes in the summer, when you go from heat into air conditioning, this is what happens. Okay. Wayne loved the weather. He was definitely into meteorology. He loved to rock hunt. He loved to metal detect. He was also a horse farm manager for his dad's farm. So he really was very active. He was also active at Lincoln Bible Church. We actually, you know, introduced me to going to church and everything. And he was... Good father, my oldest was seven years old when he died. So it was kind of, we went through a hard period for a while. We think of him every day and we miss him. And tomorrow would be his birthday. So I'm probably gonna, most likely I will make something on his birthday also. Okay, I'm gonna slice these peaches up. Okay, for the topping, I'm going to add in three fourths cup of brown sugar. There we go. I'm adding in I just want to double check something. I made a mistake with the flour. I'm adding in a half a cup of flour. Okay. I'm adding in a. I'm adding in a quarter cup of oats. Okay, that should be enough. I'm gonna mix this together. Okay. I'm going to add a little bit more oats. When something doesn't look right, what you have to do is double check it. Sometimes the recipe is a false recipe. I just think that we need a little bit more oats. All right, so we're going to add in another third cup. That'd be a little less than a third. Here we go. All right, a little bit more. I just want to be, have a little bit more oats in there. All right, we're going to mix this together. Yeah, this is much better. everything together. I'm trying to brown sugar has a habit of clumping a little bit. I don't know why. Now what we're going to do now is we're going to pour it. I'm going to put a drop of water in here. There we go. So we get some juice, all right? We need a little bit of juice in here. Now we're going to add in the topping. Great peach crisp. He always had such a sweet tooth, Wayne. <clears throat> he just absolutely loved sweets. But he was sick for a good many years, and it was so hard with his diet. He was on a very strict diet, and it was really hard for him. Now, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to add in about five squares of unsalted butter. It can be hard, it can be soft, it doesn't matter. It's going to melt in the oven. Okay. We're going to cook this for about 15, 20 minutes. This is something I know Wayne would absolutely have loved. Okay, what I want to do now is I'm going to add on a teaspoon of whole cinnamon. And we're going to cook in the oven for about five more minutes until it's done. All right. Here we have homemade peach crisp in honor of my first husband, Wayne. He absolutely loved anything sweet at all that he can eat. He absolutely loved it. And I always made him something sweet, especially on his birthday, which is going to be tomorrow, which is sad that he died the day before his birthday. It was really sad. It was very traumatic, but... You know, we know he's in a better place, and I know he's happy where he is. From Deborah Wade's Home Country Kitchen, have a great day, and please subscribe to my show.